Are you stuck trying to create an Apple ID, but the verification code never arrives? You're not alone. This issue is affecting users in the USA, Nigeria, Philippines, and many other countries. In this video, I'll show you a quick and 100% working solution to the Apple ID error. Verification code can't be sent to this phone number at this time. You'll learn how to bypass this, set up your Apple ID, and start using your iPhone normally again. This error usually happens when Apple blocks your phone number, especially if you're using a non-US SIM card or VPN. It often says, this phone number cannot be used, please try again later, or verification code not sent, try again later. It's frustrating, but don't worry, we've got you. For example, in this video, I used a number from the country which has issues while creating Apple ID. When I try to verify it, get this annoying error. Could not connect to iCloud. Verification codes can't be sent to this phone number at this time. Please try again later. Let's fix this. First of all, reset your phone to factory settings. I mean, erase all content and settings. You can borrow any other iPhone if you have important data. I did speed up my video to save time. On setup screen, choose country USA or Canada. If you are from USA and facing this verification code issue, then choose country Canada. Follow each and every step carefully. Use a passcode. It would be helpful later. Here choose to create a new Apple ID. Choose name, birthday, and Apple. You must be 18 years older to create Apple ID.
Now here choose country USA or Canada, as I chose USA. No matter what's your country but here, you must choose any of these two. Now choose any random USA or Canada number. If you choose USA, then I would suggest 6462552 and then any three digits. Now it will ask for a verification code here. You choose verify. Later, if you chose Kenya, then choose 6472552 and then any digits always works for me. Apple ID setup has been created before any verified number. But it's risky. So next step is to secure Apple ID. Complete setup wizard, and then first of all, disable, find my iPhone. It is necessary because if we still fails to verify original number or somehow get locked or disabled Apple iCloud account, then at least we will not get stuck with activation lock iCloud lock. Now we will add original number. Come back to Settings Home and tap on Verify Number. Here choose to verify with another number. Enter lock screen code 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, or whatever you chose during setup. Number choose your correct country and enter your number without zero or without country code. This time you will get OTP 100%. Enter your OTP to verify. After successful verification, we will fix App Store. Usually, if we create Apple ID in newer devices, it doesn't ask for review. But when we log an ID in older device, then it asks for review. And most of the times, when we try to review it, show purchase failed or any other error. So simply open App Store and then tap on Apple ID. And then here, we will tap on Region. Change your region. Enter any address. You can get postal codes from the Google, so address doesn't really matter during first setup. Changing region will work like reviewing Apple ID in App Store. So App Store will no longer ask for review in any Apple device.
after finishing with phone number, address, and app store. There's still one more important thing to do. We will remove temporary phone number from account. So go to Settings, tap on iCloud Account. Here in Security, tap on Two-Step Verification. Here you can see two phone numbers. One is your verified other that was being used in setup. Simply remove that unknown number, and that's it. We have successfully created fully working and secured Apple ID. Now you will receive OTP whenever you try to log in in any other device. You can check App Store if it's working fine. In App Store, when you try to download any app for the first time, it may show license agreements due to the region change. Just accept everything. If this helped you, make sure to like the video, subscribe, and share it with friends in the USA, UK, Nigeria, or Philippines who are stuck too. This is AM, founder of GSM6.com, helping you solve real Apple problems. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.